Hello and welcome to another Sights and Sounds video here in Costa Rica. This is San Isidro. All right, so I hope you enjoyed some of that drone footage here from just about three hours south of San Jose, Costa Rica. We are in San Isidro, nice little town surrounded by mountains. And here's the Iglesia, the church. So many towns here in Costa Rica are centered around their church. As you can see, it's really cool, really cool architecture. And it's always flanked by a really nice park where everybody sits. If this is your first time joining us here, be sure to like this video, hit subscribe right here on YouTube. And as always, leave us a comment. If you subscribe, leave me a comment so I know who's interested in traveling here to Costa Rica for your vacation. Leave any requests down in the comments as well. And check the top comment and in the description, I'm going to link a bunch of related videos to this location. Some ambient walking tours we've done in the area, some accommodations from this area if you're interested in coming here to this cool little town. Check out this cool statue. There's always so many cool, like, uh, unique statues and architecture around the church in the central park in each town there you go do a quick walk here of this park so once again we're about three hours south of san jose and it's not too far as the bird flies but you're driving through a national park to get here and it's up and down a lot of up and down seas or you can head out to the coast and head through punta Arenas, drive south through Jaco, and you'll eventually reach dominical and there's a road that comes into Dominical, or from Dominical to San Isidro. So there's some cool, cool statues. So this town is a part of San Jose province. And my understanding from speaking with people who live here is that San Jose province gets, let's, let's call it a better allocation of funding. So, you know, you can definitely see the, uh, the infrastructure here is really nice. There seems to be less concern about crime. You know, a lot of towns that I go to, they're boarded up or more more concerned about security and theft. Seems that everybody here is getting along really nice. So there's a really cool statue. You know, mother giving giving life. What's more important than that? And this is a busy little town too. Right, and one thing I notice here is there's sidewalks like everywhere, even on the outskirts of town. There's sidewalks. And it's not too busy. We're here, it's just rainy season now. So yesterday it was raining pretty heavy. Today, not so bad. It's nice and clear out. And there's just so many shops here. So many cool things to see. So the main road is actually up that way. There's a road that cuts through Perez Zeladon, north to south. So if you head north, you'll go to San Jose. If you head south, you'll end up in a town called Buenos Aires. And I've been there, it's really nice. And if you continue down south, you'll actually end up at a town called Palmira Norte, which is uh, just near Uvita. So to give you a sense of where you can travel to, but Dominical is not very far from here. You're not gonna drive much more than an hour from this location to get to Dominical. There's tons of shops, tons of cool shops around here. So I actually just did a ambient walking tour of this area. We started in the farmer's market. We head up around here. I'll link that down below as well, if you want to watch that. So there's lots of shoe stores, lots of restaurants. And where we're actually staying for this trip is further up in the mountains in a little town called Rivas. So it's super nice up there. And the cool thing about this area is all the food is grown here. It seems like everything is grown in this valley. 
around the Rio General. Because it, uh, it's always temperate here, it's always raining. So the air is very agreeable, let's call it. Just head back to the park. So once again, if you want to see a longer walk around this area, definitely check out the ambient video that we posted. And if you're coming here, leave me a comment of some other things that should be on the short list for checking out here. So thanks for watching. Once again, be sure to like this video, subscribe right here on YouTube, and leave us a comment. Say hello, request, or answer anybody's questions. A lot of people ask questions down in the comments. Hope to see you soon here in Costa Rica. Bye now.